Good morning, good afternoon, and good night. Welcome back to another episode of City Skylines Sunset Harbor DLC. We are here in the great city of Kelly Creek, and as you can tell, it is definitely filling in at a very rapid pace. For today, I would like to go into how to build a City Skylines downtown layout. So, I have decided to place our downtown region in this area. Now, the number one issue we have here is pretty simple. We're gonna just delete tree by tree. No, I'm just kidding. So, so let's go over here and delete all the trees. So, what I would like to do is, I would like to, wow, that is a big, wow, that is a big radius. Anyways, for today, like I mentioned, we are going to build the City Skylines downtown road layout. So, let's get over here and let's get started. So, what I want to do is grab a medium sized road and like I mentioned, I would like to place it right around over here. So what I want to do is I want to place a road that is 34, 80 and bam. Okay, cool. So now that we have this in place, we're done. Yes, we're done guys. Yes, we are done for the day. No, what we're going to do next is, so when you're building a downtown, you kind of want a city center where people can walk around catch transport like basically a transportation hub but it not being a transportation hub so that's what we're doing over here and so I'm gonna have a road that goes all the way down here we're gonna make sure that there's no traffic on this road only the buses and then the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna add some tram tracks so we're grabbing our tram only track and we're gonna place it right about here and go straight across so i know the trams are not down here yet but this is just kind of future proofing our our lovely downtown area so what we're going to do next is pretty simple we're just going to put paths so people can walk this entire you know walk to the center of town hey if they have to cross down they can they can cross it if they want to you know, basically we're giving them tons of options to be able to move around. And this also, when we include a metro area in our city, um, we can also add metro stations along here. So, all right. So now that we have this perfect little plus sign, which I honestly did not realize I did until just now, we're going to come over here. We're going to grab this and we're going to go 240. And just go over here okay so see how we have this center oh well that's that's a little bit hilly but we have this nice little view of a million rocks which I'll have to get rid of but we're gonna put a main building so our our build is gonna be based around what building this building is called the oppression center we're gonna center we want that as centered as best as possible which I might have to use the move it tool then the next thing I want to do is put the arch. So I don't know. I've never been to St. Louis, Missouri before where the golden arch is, but I wanted to kind of have almost a Washington DC straight on view of the arch. Oh wait. And if you guys really want to save money, turn off your buildings. So turn these off so we don't lose money, but I wanted to have a straight on view of the arch from this building so it's kind of like the capitol building in the in the in washington dc so what we're going to do next is pretty simple we need to build outwards so we need to actually be you know be able to add residential and stuff like that so we're going to go out like this by i think 800 no let's let's do 600 and go all the way down like this we're gonna go straight across now i will have to add the tram lines so don't feel like you know hey what, what like how are people getting here sports monkey yeah I know I need to add the highway system I have a lot to go but this is just for the city skylines downtown layout so just letting you guys know so we're gonna go 600 do the same thing 600 600 book it up there you go okay so what we're gonna do over here is that we're just gonna fill in some of these gaps there we go just get it right there all right so we're kind of so i don't want to create a million different uh so, so say if i place the road there i don't want to create a million different street lights on our main road so we're just going to go over here and go like this 
and just fill that in. So now what you want, want to make sure you do, I already mentioned this and we already built this, but we're going to build more paths going this way. So again, we are going to have, we're going to try to make the most walkable city in city skylines. Well, I don't, I don't even know if that's a thing, but you know, I just made a thing. Anyways, um, so let's go over here and we're gonna place this. So the next thing I wanna do is, what you need to do when you're building your downtown region, you do want kind of prominent buildings. Like I already built the arch and the oppression center as you saw before. So I wanna build a couple more buildings that people will visit. So I, I mean, I don't know about the opera house. Like you could place it there. I don't wanna place the opera house. Like you could place the opera house you can place, you know, any any of these buildings that you've already unlocked, you can place, ooh, I'm just trying to look at my options right now. So I kind of like the courthouse, ooh, that, I didn't, okay, I kind of like the courthouse until I saw how big it was, woof, woof. A lot of these buildings are huge. All right, so there is one building that I know I can fit down here, which, do, 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 do. I'm just searching through my buildings right now to see what what would be the best. Now, a downtown, a downtown mall actually would not be that bad. Six and a half hours later. We have this. We have this four-way cross intersection. We're going to add some high-density residential. We're going to add some of that, um, you know, those buildings. And basically what we want to do now is we kind of created a system where we could just organically... Well, maybe not, maybe not on the beach, but we can organically grow our, our downtown region. So like you, as you can tell, I know this is gritty, but hold on. Okay. So I know, oh God, here comes the meme. Um, so I know this is gritty, but when you're, when you're in New York city or any, you know, honestly, any U S city, the cities are basically grids. So sorry in advance, and I know I said grid, so we're gonna you're gonna have that Michael Jordan meme pop up, unfortunately. But you know, it's just that's just the way it is. Wow, I don't know who sings that song, but I just never mind. I'm oof, it's not sing that song. Anyways, so we are over here, and we are creating grid. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add. Our residential areas we're gonna add some of our commercial and I'm actually gonna pause the game right now because we don't want everything to pop up on top of that we don't have a highway system over here anyways so what I'm gonna do guys is for the time being I'm gonna add some of our residential so what we want is high density residential so let's plop it there plop 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 now we don't want it throughout the entire um, like we don't want it on any of the main roads, so let's just plop over here. Plop, 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 there we go. Okay, cool. So what we're gonna do, uh, what I'm gonna do off camera is I'm gonna actually put a park in the center over here. So that's just something to keep in mind, guys, that uh, that is that is coming. So, um, you know, just remember, this is all gonna be filled in for the most part. So don't, don't worry about it. So again, this is the city skylines downtown road layout and I'm just trying to show you guys what it's gonna look like when you add your own road layout so we're I know I'm just adding commercials so that's okay but what I'm gonna do next guys is um, I will be right back I'm going to start I'm gonna start the park which I know you guys can you guys obviously know how to build the parks but you know I, I don't want to show you that on camera because I feel like you guys have already seen that for me and I don't want to bore you guys to death so guys, thank you for watching. I will fast forward and we will see you guys in a few. Two hours later. Okay guys, welcome back. We have our city that's filled in a little bit. As you can tell, um, we don't have any skyscrapers yet, but things are starting to fill in really, really well. Now you might ask, Sports Monkey, what did you put as the center park or like central park? I put a zoo. Um, obviously it's not detailed completely because we're only a level one zoo, but, um, this should grow and fill in really, really, really nicely. 
And um, what I also did was while you guys were gone, I did add the bus lines over here. As you can tell, they're going, um, I guess we can say they're going north to south. And then we have the trams going from east to west. So east to west. So um, we have that going on. So overall, um, the city downtown, City Skylines downtown layout looks really good. Obviously, we have a lot more to do. We have a lot more to fill in. Um, the number one issue we're going to have is we need to build a highway. Obviously, this is not a long-term solution. I just wanted everything to fill in a little bit so we can, you know, just show you the downtown layout. But thank you guys for watching. I truly do appreciate it. If you guys have any questions, please let me know in the comment section below. But thank you guys for watching. Have a great rest of your day.